If a task consists of a sequence of choices in which there are P selections for the first choice and Q for the second choice, then the task of making these selections can be done in how many different ways? So look, P for the first and Q for the second, you mean, uh, you know that and means multiplication, so it'd be P times Q. Assume an automobile license plate consists of three letters followed by two digit number. How many distinct license plates can be formed if there are no restrictions? So let's first do no restrictions. So you have three letters followed by a two digit number. So it would be like this. So first is a letter and you have 26 choices for that. And then second is a letter, you have 26 choices for that. Let's say, insert symbol, okay, point. 26 for the second, so let's zoom in a bit. And then you have 26 choices for the third. So three letters, and then you have a two digit number. And uh, there, there are 10 digits, one through nine and zero. So for the digits, you will have 10 choices for the first digit, and then again, 10 choices for the second digit. So you multiply all this, so 226 cube and then two zeros, so 26, okay. 26 raised to power three. And then you have two more zeros for the two tenths, so one seven, Five seven six zero zero. One seven five seven six zero zero. How many distinct license plates can be formed if the letters O and I are not used? So if O and I are not used, then instead of twenty six, we have only twenty four letters available. So we go back. So all these 26s will now become 24s. So it'll be 24 cubed times 100. So that'd be 24 power three. 13824 and then two zeros. 138240. Zero. One. The owner of a stereo wants to advertise that he has many different sound systems in stock. The store carries eight CDs, six receivers, and ten speakers. Assuming a sound system consists of one of each, uh, how many different sound systems are possible? So you want, uh, so you have eight selections from the CDs. So you'll do eight times and you have six selection and six selections from the receivers so and means multiplication and then you have 10 for the speakers so you multiply the three and that's eight times six is 48 so that'd be 480 Suppose a local area network requires six letters for usernames, lower and uppercase are considered the same. How many usernames are possible? Um, okay, so you have six letters. So every spot has um, 26 choices. So if you go back here, so it's like uh, 26 for the first spot. Those are 26 in the alphabet. You have 26 for the second spot, 26 for the third spot, 26 for the fourth spot, 
26 for the fifth spot and then there are six of them so you have another one 26 so 26 multiplied by itself six times like 26 power 6 so 26 power 6 